Are you filming, lady? Mm -hmm. Okay, so visit number dos. Um, you see me all right? It's bumpy. But you can see me? Sort of. What do you mean, sort of? I am a person who should be seen and not heard. Uh, <laughs> so, anyways, it's uh, visit number two. And we are going there in about a half hour. But right now, we're just going to get a coffee. So, um, if Darcy would pause it for a few minutes, because we just got to the drive through and idiot here wants to take up a whole lane. How are you filming? Mm -hmm. Okay, we well, gotta warn the guy. Uh, hi guys. It's really bumpy. I know, Regina Street, so I can't say, hey, we're in Regina, the place that rhymes with fun. Um, so it is visit number two with the bariatric clinic. Now, my weight on our first visit was 460, what? Four, 464 point something, point six. 464 point six. So we're going for a weigh in today. I've been kind of, I've been, we've been actually doing pretty damn good in the uh, diet side of it. Exercise, I've been doing good because of my job. How you doing in the exercise department, Darcy? She puts thumbs up, which is a dirty, dirty lie. Um, food poisoning counts as exercise. So apparently food poisoning counts as exercise, guys. So 464 points, blah, 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 blah. Um, now today we're going to be talking with dietitian, with uh, physiotherapist. Uh, are, am I going to see my surgeons again today? I'm going to see my surgeon again today. We're going to get some more information. I hope all the questionnaires are done. Uh, psychologist, are we the psychologist today too? So we meet with everybody today and then this afternoon is like an exercise session. Um, they're gonna teach me how to exercise. Which is funny because the doctor is like, it's just okay, we're not gonna make you guys do any like crazy Richard Simmons kind of aerobics. And I was giggling inside because I do Richard Simmons all the time. I actually love doing I love doing the Richard Simmons aerobics. Um, I I think they're fun. It's dancing, and as a guy who never dances, you know it's sometimes nice to get your jig along. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So uh, it's almost eight o'clock. My appointment is for eight thirty. I believe the other two ladies that were there last time will be there again today. Correct? Darcy's nodding yes because everybody can see her behind the camera. Um, other than that, guys, uh, nothing much to re uh, report. Uh, I'm going to go for my official weigh-in, which sucks here because their scale is heavier than my scale at home, um, but their scale is more precise than my scale at home. So, stay, stay, good car. Um, that's it. I will see you guys after the appointment. I may sneak in a couple little videos uh, during the appointment. So, laters. Action. Um, so, today was a pretty in-depth day. We got finished around 12.30. The first meeting we had was with a dietitian, and I made a mistake by bringing my morning coffee in there. Uh, she wants me to wean myself off of coffee. She wants me to start uh, weaning myself off of soda pop. We learned that... Um, she wants me to really diligently track my calories, which I sort of kind of do, but when we're off track, I don't. So she just wants me to diligently track my calories for the next couple days and eat normally. So I have been, uh, after all the stuff we went out for lunch to Wendy's, and I had a Baconator and a baked potato and a wrap, which was 900, no, 1,600 freaking calories. The Baconator alone was 900 and some cows, which is cray cray, but it is what it is. Uh, we then met, is there anything else the dietitian there? That's noteworthy. No. She wants me to eat 2,600 cows a day. So I'm going to try. 
next meeting was with a psychologist. The psychologist was pretty... It was a pretty easy meeting because I'm pretty in touch with myself psychologically. Uh, I have a very good support system, i.e. my wife, her parents. So she gave me some tools to utilize. One is called the Weight Loss Surgery Workbook. I'll order that from Amazon tonight. And was there anything else with the psychologist? No. Uh, yeah, that was it for the psychologist. Next was the exercise therapist. Uh, all of these, well, the the dietitian was very cut and dry. She really didn't. Would you call her no BS kind of woman? She was a little bullshit kind of woman. Uh, the, the psychologist... The psychologist was a really nice lady, I think. Um, and the, the exercise therapist, she was really surprised on what I'm physically capable of doing at my size. But as I was talking to your favorite and my favorite, Michael Aldridge, we, we both are like that, but we both put it up to our athletic background. So with the exercise therapist, she gave me a workout schedule, not a workout schedule, she wants me to do 150 minutes of working out a week. So very easy to do. Uh, I had to run on a treadmill for six minutes, or brisk walk on a treadmill for six minutes. I had to touch, attempt to touch my toes. And then... Sit and stand. Oh, sit and stand. You know, from a sitting position to a standing position. Sitting position to a standing position. It is as many as you could in 15 seconds. I did six, which makes me sad. So, today is kind of, was just that. It was to get the first game plan going. So, they've given me their list of recommendations... Uh, we are going to be starting them as of today's Thursday, Saturday. I think Saturday is a good day to start. Um, as I said, the dietitian wants me to eat normally. So I have actually been eating a little bit extra today, kind of just to pump up my calories to see where I'm at. But back to normality tomorrow, and then from normality to starting to look at the future of my life, dietary, exercise, and mentally. We went to GNC today, bought $250 worth of uh, Quest bars and uh, protein powder because we're, I'm getting rid of Slim Fast because it's 31 grams of sugar. And I've known this, but it's a good meal. I thought it was at least it was a decent meal substitute. Especially when I had it in the morning because at least I had the opportunity to work off that sugar throughout the day. She didn't agree with that. She though. didn't agree with that. So I went to GNC. I bought two big tubs of uh, protein powder. Double chocolate, I think, is the kind I got. Double chocolate royale. Double chocolate royale. And we'll see how that is next time we go up to Regina. Or the next time one of my friends go up to Regina or to Moose Jaw or to Madison Hat. I'll get them to pick me up a different flavor. I just didn't want to have to spend four or $500 at GNC today. So with that being said, my friends, uh, this will be... Oh, weigh-in. Official. Official doctor's office weigh-in was 450... Eight. 58.4 so that is down of 8 pounds 6 six pounds in one week uh, like I said my scale at home is different than their scale but for an everyday weight we're going to use my scale but for the official weight loss scale we are going to be using the doctor's office scale because that is the scale that my doctors will be using they won't be using my own home scale so that being said, eight pounds down, 
Six. Uh, six pounds down. Fifty-eight to go. And we got some tools back there. We went grocery shopping. It's uh, on my Donkey Kong. Now, my next meeting with the uh, bariatric program is April the 19th, 18th, 17th, 16th, 15th, 14th, 13th. Woo, I win the car. Price is right. Um, uh, what's that? It's the clock game where they do that, right? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, with that being said, I am going to uh, come to you guys once a week uh, just to give you updates on my scale. My wife is getting tired of holding my phone, so I'm going to make this quick. I can always hold it and drive while holding my phone. You've already been talking for 7 minutes and 20 seconds. Oh, Darcy, I've made videos that have lasted an hour. <laughs> uh, I love to talk. Anyways. Oh, actually, no, we'll talk about the lyrics of Darcy's arms hurting. Video once a week. Video once a week. I'm going to come to you guys with a way day video. Uh, kind of just a little update of how it's gone. If you want, you can join me on my fitness pal because I now have to start logging and I actually have to give my dietitian my password, username and password, so she can go in and check up on me. Um, yeah, so Chris and Monty, all one word, C H R I S A N D M O N T E Y. For those of you who want to join me on my fitness pal, track my success through there or lack of. And there's always this, so like, comment, subscribe. Um, if there's anybody else in your life right now who is wondering about having this surgery and want to know the steps and what's going to happen, please share this with them. Let them know. I'm a pretty open book, you guys. You know I'll tell you anything. You even told that to the psychologist. But I'm getting the glares, so I got to go. You're not. Later.